Ms. Aurora is in here having a self isolini okay? We can't be in a rush to go too many places right now. I want all of the secured entrepreneurs to post a picture of your self isolini <laughs> okay? Or give me a video of you enjoying your self isolini okay? <laughs> Here's what we know. We know that 1,700 people become millionaires every day in the United States. I didn't stutter. 1,700 people become millionaires every day in the United States. We also know that 80% of these millionaires are first generation millionaires. They did not inherit the money. With this being the case, why then is it that entrepreneurs are attempting to file for unemployment. Why then is it that entrepreneurs are attempting to file unemployment? In this video, I'm going to answer the questions that some of you have been emailing us here as it relates to your eligibility for unemployment and some of you who stated that you did file and you were denied. Miss Aurora is going to tell you just why you were denied and just why it is the entrepreneur has absolutely no business even thinking about an unemployment claim. You already know that I am Aurora Day and this is the Secured Entrepreneur Movement. So for the entrepreneurs who have been emailing us here, and thank you for continuing to email us, please continue to do so at info at auroradayconsulting.com. For the entrepreneurs who are saying that during, the time of, during this time of the pandemic, you sincerely felt as though you qualified to receive unemployment because you have been working a business and you've been working a business that is that has been considered non-essential. And during the time when we were shut down, your business was considered non-essential. You did not make any money. You filed for unemployment. You were denied. This is also going for the entrepreneurs who are emailing saying, you feel as though at this juncture, you have no other choice but to try to file an unemployment claim. And you're saying, do, do, does Miss Aurora feel like you'll be able to do it? First of all, there are four qualifying factors for, for a small business owner to be able to collect unemployment that Miss Aurora knows of. So the secure entrepreneurs in the community chime in on this conversation because here's what Miss Aurora is going to say to all of you who are emailing regarding this subject. First, to collect unemployment, you need to be an employee. So you would have to go about proving that you in, you in fact were an employee of your company. Well, how would you do that? Well, you would have had to have taken a tax election. You would have stated that you are an employee, created a payroll, commence to give yourself a paycheck, okay? Now, because now you have uh, elected, you, you, you've taken a tax election, you have stated that you are an employee of that company, you are issuing yourself a paycheck, well then now the second qualification is that you are paying federal and state unemployment tax. You're paying federal and state unemployment tax. Okay. After that, now you have got to prove that you have lost your employee status. Well, how would you have lost your employee status? Well, you're saying that during this pandemic, my business is no longer essential. I'm no longer working. I'm the employee. I've been playing, paying federal and state unemployment tax. I deserve to get unemployment. Okay. And then the fourth thing is that 
you've got to be willing to seek alternative employment as you are collecting this unemployment pay, all right? So, for many of you, what has Ms. Aurora been, been saying for the longest time? When you have a real business and you want to say, okay, I'm an employee, which Ms. Aurora does not understand that because you know, we here in the Secured Entrepreneur Movement do not do the 1040 lifestyle. We're not employees, okay? We control some things, but we're not going to be an employee. We did that before, okay? So these are the valuable lessons that you are learning now as it relates to setting up your business correctly, okay? So you did not take a tax election and state fully that you were an employee of a bona fide company. You did not set up a payroll to where you were paying yourself and was paying the federal and state unemployment tax. Therefore, you could not say you actually lost your employment and let's be real, how willing are you to now seek alternative employment while you're collecting an unemployment paycheck. Hmm. <laughs> so now Mr. Rora is going to tell you why it is you don't have any business even thinking about filing an unemployment claim if in fact you are the entrepreneur and or small business owner that you're telling Ms. Aurora you have been via your emails, okay? For starters, I started the video telling you that 1,700 people a day become millionaires. 80% of those people are first generation millionaires and they're self-made millionaires. I didn't get into the global numbers, okay? So that means that there's a system. There's a system. And there's a system that works across the board, all right? Ms. Aurora has told you before to tweak whatever it is that you are selling. What is your product? What is your service, okay? And where are you showing up? Have you invested? Have you, do you have advertisements? Now, you all know that there are people who use the heaven out of Craigslist, okay? Now, I'm just, I'm just throwing some stuff out here because you all know that Miss Aurora is gonna, you know, I'm a cash machine. Many of you already know that. This is a daily situation, okay? And so I'm reading your emails and a lot of you are saying, you know, if you could, you would do certain things. Now, we know that YouTube, YouTube ads don't really cost a lot of money, all right? Facebook ads are a little bit more expensive and, and they've got a whole lot more going on there, but YouTube is one of the better places to get seen internationally. And what does Ms. Aurora constantly tell all of the secured entrepreneurs? You have got to prepare your business for international success, okay? I have seen people draw the crowd on Craigslist. Now, I understand that you gotta be slick about that because they will remove your ads, but I'm saying it's free. There are tons of places locally for you to advertise yourself, okay? I see people stick up their cards and stick up their advertisements in the juice bar, at the coffee shop, okay? This, my neighbor, her, she said that her washing machine and dryer broke down and she was very, very happy that during the pandemic, not only was she able to go to the laundromat, okay, while she was waiting for the repair, but she actually found somebody to come and fix something that was broke in her house. Why? Because they had an advertisement on the bulletin board in the laundromat, okay? So, the reality of the situation is there are no excuses. You don't need to even think that you're going to go out there and file an employment. And, and some of you were saying you wanted to do it because of all these people telling you about these extra benefits they were getting and how they felt like they didn't have a need to try to really look for work or go back to work. They were going to ride it out. Well, well, we know that the additional monies have come to a screeching halt. Yes, it is a wrap. Please do not let 
unemployment benefits look this juicy to you, okay? The reality of your situation is that you have got to find a way to believe in yourself again, because I'm, I'm understanding what you're saying in your emails, okay? Believe in yourself again. Believe in the product and the service that you are offering to the public and know that what it is that you are offering is needed by a whole lot of people. When you show up and you show up in front of your target audience, they're going to pay attention. Okay, so I know that in this time, people have lost it. You know, most people have lost so much hope. It is just totally ridiculous. But once again, I'm just very happy that you all are reaching out because the last thing that we want is to feel alone and to be alone, especially while we're trying to uh, get our lives together during a global pandemic. So now, if you want to get a real business set up, you come and talk to Miss Aurora. The links are down below if you are here on YouTube. Facebook will put something up on, uh, above the video on Facebook. Okay? So you all know that you can find me, Miss Aurora, at auroradayconsulting.com. And until next time, ta-ta.